Hi, James. Hi, James. Hi, Bogey. Hi, Joe. How are you? Fantastic. Good. How are you? I'm doing pretty good. I'm, I'm ready to learn about doing cars. I mean, Motor Trends Garage Squad. <laughs> Tell me something about it. I was looking to, to, to take a good look at the screener, but didn't get a chance to. But Garage Squad is self-explanatory. And Joe, forgive me. My mom's watching me. Bogey has to go first. Hey, that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Uh, you know, Garage Squad is a is a different kind of show. It's a it's about the cars. It's about sharing tips and tricks. But really, it's about a whole nother layer of things, which is about the people. And it's really helping them with their dream vehicles. Most of them don't really know how to work on their own cars. So it's a ton of fun to be able to go in and help these folks get their cars running again and really be a part of their lives for the week that we're with them. Joe, how did you get started building these cars? What was your passion? Uh, you know, I was just one of those kids that was born with a pair of pliers and a screwdriver in his hand while I was still in diapers. I mean, that's just who I was. Um, Everyone in my family is some sort of gearhead, mechanic, uh, farmer. I mean, you name it, uh, anything really kind of to do with this industry. Um, I wanted to be a mechanic, you know, my whole life. Uh, why most kids were in third grade wanting to be an astronaut or, you know, a fireman. I was raising my hand. I want to be a diesel mechanic. So it's just something that is, uh, you know, it, it's in my DNA, uh, and I'm blessed to have, you know, the opportunity that I have to show the world what I know how to do. So uh, it, it's been a great ride so far. I'm loving every minute of it. Boogie, I got a question for you. I mean, being a female in this industry, uh, what's it like working with these guys and surprising them with the knowledge you know? And then the other side of it is, what would you tell other women who are interested? You know, it, it has been interesting being a woman in this industry. Uh, working with the guys uh, in the squad has been, it, it's its easy. They're great guys. They're a ton of fun to work with. They, there's a lot of playful banter that happens. They like to give me a hard time. But uh, <laughs> I think at the end of the day, coming in and being able to, you know, really kind of, I think, surprise them a little bit with how much I know and how experienced I am working on cars. That's, that's always fun. It's always fun when people underestimate you and you get to... Uh, surprise them a little bit and you know for other women in the industry or wanting to get in the industry this is a phenomenal phenomenal industry for women to get into or for anybody to get into there's a ton of opportunity and i just encourage anybody if it's something you're interested in pursue it don't let anything or anyone stop you from doing it yes speaking of which how did you get started in this how did you what age did you get started and how did it pique your interest I got started when I was about 16 years old. I knew nothing about cars. My parents don't know where I came from, but I was in love with Volkswagen Bugs and I bought one and decided that I wanted to restore it from the ground up. So I enrolled in high school auto shop and the, the rest is history. Bogey, I, I like the fact both Volkswagen Bug, because I had a Volkswagen bus when I was in nice. college and I, I loved it. I had so much fun. We won't talk about that. We want to talk about that. <laughs> Joe. <laughs> I hear Joe laughing. Joe, uh-huh. See yeah, there, a Joe? Little bit. <laughs> <laughs> so how did you two get involved with Garage Squad? Where did this idea come from? Well, in the beginning, you know, the uh, Garage Squad was a really a bunch of ideas uh, that we kind of had to weed through what was going to work. And so it kind of started off, you know, it really wasn't going to be what it is today. It was kind of going to be, you know, throw on some valve covers and, and, you know, some Chrome and replace shocks. And, uh, you know, after, you know, analyzing, we realized it's really not going to work. You know, we need to do something that is a little bit more relatable to the guy in the garage. That's, you know, uh, building, you know, his own custom vehicle per se, or just trying to get that car that his dad, you know, has had for 30 years back up on the road and try to do something that no one else has done and try to be more realistic about it with a budget and with time. And, uh, you know, with we're, you know, we're truly dealing with cars that have been in barns for 40 years. And we're trying to show everybody that you can bring this back to life. 
Uh, you can bring the hobby for you and your family back to life. And believe it or not, because of how much people love these cars, it's bringing back to life, you know, some of the relationships and families. And I think that's more important than anything, really. Now, before I let you two go, Bogey, well, let's talk a little bit about All Girls Garage. So All, All Girls Garage is how I got my start in, in television. Um, and of course, how the, the squad found me. Um, but All Girls Garage has been on for about 10 years now, going into our 11th season next year. And, and that's, that's a lot of fun as well. All Girls Garage is definitely more focused on the cars. And so it's fun to be able to do both, where I get to focus really on the cars, on All Girls Garage, and then on Garage Squad, really bring in my love for, for really teaching people, but also helping and working with people. Man, that sounds pretty cool. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry, Joe. I think I'd rather watch All Girls Garage than the Garage Squad. So forgive me. Oh. You can watch both. <laughs> <laughs> you can watch both. That's the beauty of it. <laughs> if you get Motor Trend Plus for 99 cents a month, I think you can watch both. I think that'll work out great. Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> and you just heard Joe's little feelings. <laughs> a little little one. The one I got. Just right, Bogey? <laughs> 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 Bogey Lattner, Joe Zolper, thank you so much for joining us on Morning Blend and talking about Garage Squad. Thank you.